Well, here is my new camera. It's the ZWO 1600 Mono Cooled Camera. And this is everything that came in the box. And this is the camera itself. And you can see uh, on the back here, all the, the ports. It actually has a USB hub, which is kind of cool. And this is the, the connection that will lead into the, the blue thing here. That will lead into the, the laptop. Uh, this is the power supply right there, or where the power supply should plug in, and sadly, it actually doesn't come with its own power adapter. So if you don't have a power cord laying around, you're going to need a new one, 12 volt. And these are the other things that came with the package. This is the 1.25 inch adapter, which will plug right into the telescope. There's another adapter. I'm not sure well that will come into play if I'll need that piece. Uh, this is the USB 3.0 cable that goes from the camera into your computer. Um, I don't actually have USB 3.0, I have 2.0, so I, hopefully it's it's backwards compatible. Um, there's another ring or plate, I'm not sure where that will come into play. And it uh, looks like some maintenance pieces, if anything ever wears out, I'll have to read up on that. And it comes with two short USB cables. Uh, it looks like they're USB cables, probably to plug your, your guide camera into the USB hub on this camera. It might save you some wires dangling around. So that's everything that comes with the package. Um, and the drivers, of course, but I'll probably get the latest ones online. So, you know, just when I learned how to use my DSLR, I'm changing things up and going with this camera. We'll see what happens. And uh, I'm doing this upgrade mainly because I just can't pick off some very faint nebula. Um, so maybe this will help. All right. Oops. See you later. Well, here it is attached to my telescope. Um, minus the cables right now. I just wanted to make sure once it's attached that I'm still in balance and I checked everything out and nothing needed to be changed. So this pretty much seems to be the same weight as my DSLR that it's replacing. So now for the real test. Will it actually work and how long will it take me to figure out? I'm not looking forward to this. Anyway, see you later. Hello there. All right. I am trying my ZWO camera for the very first time. This is how my guiding is looking, but that's not what we're really trying to achieve here. Um, let's go to nebulosity. And this is my very first light with my new camera. Um, one picture is done so far. I'm doing two minute exposures. Right there, the duration is 120 seconds. Uh, ISO is now replaced with gain. And I think gain 120 is a standard setting. Um, offset, I'm not even sure what that is, but again, um, offset 20 is another standard setting. I'm only going with 10 exposures because um, the clouds are rolling in. I don't have much time. But as for one picture so far, my very first picture, I can actually see some nebulosity here. So I'm hoping this camera works out well we'll have to see um, I had to shrink it to fit it on here oops maybe that's too much let's go up a little more yeah so I'm pretty happy because it was actually pretty easy to focus and uh, I did my reading beforehand so oh I think it just finished another picture so maybe I'll get a few more off now what I'm not sure is how exactly to achieve my darks and my bias flats that that's a whole nother matter but anyway thanks for listening see you later